The real estate market's continuing to do really weird stuff. You don't want to miss this monthly market update. What is up everyone? I'm Brian, the beekeeping realtor, and welcome to the monthly market update. Every single time we do a monthly market update, we always look at last month's numbers because this month hasn't happened yet. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and let's just dig right in. So right off the bat, the median sales price countywide is $880,000. That is a 5% increase compared to this time last year, but actually a slight decrease from the 882,000 it was this time last month. The median days on market are 22, which is up compared to the 19 we had this time last year. The number of active listings is 1,420, which is a huge jump, a 43% jump from the 993 we had this time last year, and a decent jump from the almost 1,300 we had this time last month. The number of new listings was 712 compared to 624 this time last year. The number of sold listings was 495, which is almost the same as the 497 we had this time last year. The overall month supply, which is if we were to stop listing homes today, how long would it take for us to sell, is sitting right at 3.19, a huge jump from the 1.98 we had this time last year, and a big jump from what we had last month at 2.88. And overall interest rates are sitting right at 6.4%, which is down from the 7% we had last month. So is it a good time to buy? Well, I'm always gonna say the same thing. It's always a good time to buy if you're paying rent. Uh, if you're paying three or 4,000 bucks a month, that goes away every month. And yeah, sure, maybe prices will go down, but if it takes a year, you're gonna spend, what, 40, $50,000 while you wait? That's gonna wipe out any gains that you make. So forget it. If you are ready to buy, it's always a good time to buy. But if we're comparing it to the last four, six, eight years, um, this is probably one of the best times to buy that we've had in a really long time. We're not seeing bidding wars. We're not seeing crazy rushes. Interest rates just came down. So if you're thinking about buying, now is a really good time. Now, if you're in a position where you're not paying rent, you're living with mom and dad and you're not paying anything, maybe wait, right? I do think that prices will come down. But, you know, at the end of the day, if the options are pay a ton of money for rent or get a place that may possibly go down some, get the place. It's a better situation. So for sellers, is it a good time to sell? It's as good as you're going to get. It seems like prices are trending down. It seems like inventory is surging up. Overall, it seems like every single month you wait, everything is less in your favor as a seller. So if you're thinking about selling, right now is an awesome time. You can transition into a new home easier than you could have in the last six years. And it seems like you're gonna get about top dollar and about the best conditions that you can get. Doesn't seem like it's getting better. So if you're thinking about selling, I would do it now. I think that if you wait until fall or until winter or even worse until next year, I think everything's gonna get a lot tougher, a lot more competitive, and you're gonna have a much more miserable time selling your home. Granted, no crystal ball, but just what I think. So what do you think? Is it a good time to buy, a good time to sell? Put it in the comments down below. I'd love to hear your thoughts. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll catch you guys next time.